Hey guys, welcome to another Hackintosh video. Uh, you see this case? Yeah. It's a big old gray case with a, with a glass window. Here's the situation. This case had a, uh, another motherboard in it. A motherboard that was given to me by a friend in, in D.C. And, uh, the motherboard was, you know, just basically a dual core. No, it wasn't even dual core. It was a Pentium D uh, processor based uh, motherboard. And I was going to try to defy the odds and put, I don't know, Lion, try to put Lion, or I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. But somebody sent me a message not too long ago. If I, don't, I don't know if any of you guys seen it on one of my videos, but somebody sent a comment saying, why don't you get an i5? And I was like, it's not that easy. Well, you guys are in luck because I went shopping and I bought this. Oh yeah. I also bought this. Oh yeah. I also bought this. Oh yeah. I wanna do it big. I bought that. Ooh la la. And I thought I saved the best for last. You all know that I, I swear by Asus and, well, excuse me, Asus, and I swear by uh, Nvidia. Well, bayow, take a bite, bayow, and. Uh, Radeon. Yes, it's still Asus, but it's Radeon. So, the reason for this is I'm not trying to build, I'm not trying to build a super machine. Now, real quickly about this case, whatever the case may be, I'm sure you watched that video. I'm sure most of you caught that video, whatever the case may be, where I talk about cases. I was about to run back out and buy another case for this video. But I'm not trying to win a beauty contest here or a fashion show. I'm just trying to basically show you guys, hey, I don't necessarily have to use, you know, an Asus motherboard. Another thing is people always want to know which one is better. And you, there's a bunch of people on YouTube running around calling people fanboys and all that other stuff. I'm not a fanboy. I just don't give a damn. Um, if it works for me, I stick with it. I stick with the formula. Another question I got was which graphics card looks better, uh, H I mean, I'm sorry, uh, Nvidia or the Radeon cards? I've heard people say, "Oh man, I've I've done my Hackintosh with a Radeon card and it looks gorgeous and beautiful and all this, and it looks better than Nvidia." And, or, or I've heard I I would never use an Nvidia. Or I heard, yeah, I use Nvidia. I would never use a Radeon cards. Honestly, to me, I've always felt like ATI cards are crap. So, that's just my personal preference. But hey, check this out. AMD purchased ATI not too long ago. I know because I own shares of the stock. And, uh, who knows? Maybe AMD improved on something. You know what I mean? So, we're going to put this bad boy together. You know what I mean? I don't know where this video is going to go. I don't know if I'm going to... If I'm going to uh, do a tutorial, but it should be interesting. Now, oh, you know what? Here's something interesting for you. Check this out. When I purchased this thing, when I went to go, because basically, this is what happened. I went into the store to purchase uh, my parts. And the guy that works in the store, he tells me that this motherboard, well, none of his motherboards are hackintoshable. So, I'm like, you sure about that? And he's like, yes, I'm very sure. I've checked the, the websites uh, that list the parts for Hackintosh machines. And ours wasn't on the list. So, I'm like, you know what? I'm going to do my research. And he hit me with this. Yeah, you do that. Check this out. Most computer technicians... Or most of these what you call geeks. I don't mean no harm because I am a certified technician. Uh, but most of these technicians and these IT people, they're assholes. And you 
I'm sure you agree, and I'm sure most of you know what I'm talking about. They're like bona fide assholes, man. And I, you know, they treat people like they're, they're stupid. And I don't like that shit. So, me being the guy I am, I went home, hopped on all my resource sites, and, uh, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I took pictures. <laughs> I took pictures of all the uh, motherboards, and I typed the names of them in my uh, iPod, my iPod Touch, and I went home. But I by the time I got in the door, the shit was already on my computer because, because of the notes in Mountain Lion. So, I was ready to go. I went and did my homework, and this board was on the list. So, I called these guys up, ordered my parts, and I turned on my inner asshole. So, I called them, and I was like, uh, look here. Can I, have, can I tell you what I want, and you guys have my stuff waiting for me at the counter, so I can just come in, pay you, and leave? And uh, they was like, sure. I told them what I wanted, and the guy said to me, uh, well, since you're building a Hackintosh, you, uh, you sure these parts are going to work? I said, look here, we wouldn't even be having this conversation if I didn't know. And he said, oh, okay, buddy. All right. Okay. So anyway, I get there to pick up my parts. And let me show you something. Look what they did. See if I can get a good look in there for you. I noticed the box was half open. I was trying to figure out, and the guy seen me staring. He said, "Oh, let me show you what we did for you." These guys put the stuff on for me, and I was like, "Wait a minute, why do you do that?" Um, because you know I'm shooting a video here, and uh, I want to show my viewers. He's like, "We did this." You know, basically we did this to uh, pretty much help you out because uh, if you get this board home and it's damaged or something, you know, by us doing it, you could just bring it back and we'll replace it. Because, you know, nine cents out of ten, it might have been a faulty board. It's not nothing that you did. This is reassurance. This is to protect, to protect you. And I snapped and I was like, I don't need your protection, man. You know? No, I'm joking. I didn't do that. But this is what they did. The store is called Intrex. Uh, I think maybe I'll post a link to the to the site. But the point I'm trying to make to you guys is, even though you hear me talking and telling you guys, you know, what works and what don't work and so forth and so forth, it, it could be anybody. You can't listen to everything that people say. You have to Google your ass off and find out for yourself. You know, I show you things because I always believe seeing, seeing is believing, you know. So anyway, let's get started. I'm, I'm glad you guys, you guys are listening to me. I'm glad you guys are checking out my videos. I got a whole bunch of things I want to I do for March. But anyway, let's get started.